Hi, this is Nell Foster with Joyous Garden and today I'm going to tell you how to sterilize gardening tools. In all reality, it's hard to get it 100% sterilized unless you have a sterilizing chamber or some really heavy chemical solution and I don't use chemicals. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you how I really give mine a good disinfecting. First of all, you want to make sure your tools are clean. So how I clean mine is I clean it with Bonami and a solution of vinegar and water sprayed over. I go and I scrub, scouring pad, I make sure everything's nice and clean. The tools, the, the um, and then, not the tools, and the mechanisms here are all nice and clean. And then I will dry that off. And then I use either alcohol or hydrogen peroxide. And what I will do is I will actually pour it in full strength into a container, a small container, if I'm only doing a few pruning, pruning tools. If you, if you need to do a shovel or something bigger, if that's gotten infected, then you can use a pail for that. So what I will do is I will open it up because you want to make sure the blades are, are exposed in there. And I will just let it set for like an hour. And then I will take it out. And as I said, you, and you, you want to make sure that this part is all down into the alcohol. If you think your handles have somehow gotten, gotten infected, you want to put the whole thing under, but hopefully they have not. They have not. Um, and then you dry it off. Make sure it's thoroughly dry. And I usually put a little bit of a olive oil on this part just to keep it good and lubed up so it doesn't rust and it's good to go. Now you can also use Lysol or something like a disinfecting cleanser if you use anything stronger. As, as I said, I don't. Some people I've read use bleach. I've never used bleach because I've heard that it, it can corrode the, the tools and I don't want that so I'm not going to use bleach at all. And if you're out in the field and in between prunes, you can either just have your alcohol in your apron and then just put it on the rag and just you can just clean here. And when using any kind of solution, you want to make sure you protect your hands and your clothing, of course. And you just uh, give it a good clean in between, in between the cuts. This is Nell Foster and I have just shown you how to sterilize gardening tools.